Well, good afternoon, everybody. My name is Sonia Trevino. I'm with Remax Universal, and I have with me here today Mr. Daniel Najera with Houston Mortgage, and. Um, we're going to start something funny for you guys. We're going to do, do daily bloopers for buyers. That's and, right. Uh, I think bloopers. it's uh, throw a little comedy out there on things That's that right. buyers should not do. Don't take it as serious, right? Don't okay. take it too serious. Maybe. Yet, very important. Very important, yeah. yes. So what can you tell us, Daniel, so, in yeah. your experience? Commonly, what, you know, the main blooper, what that is, changing jobs. You know, once you start, you get into a contract, needless to say, changing a job is going to set you back from closing. You know, you're talking about waiting anywhere between 30 to 60 days, not from the day you start, but after you get your first paycheck, right? Mm -hmm. So, needless to say, that's going to jeopardize your mortgage loan. Um, secondly, it's going to be the uh, uh, credit. Make sure you, you don't maximize your credit cards. If you have balances or whatever the balance is from the time you apply for the loan, that's how your mortgage professional will qualify you with. So, you got to maintain those balances the same way, you know, and not have. Uh, you gotta think about the very last minute, the day before closing, they do what's called QC, Sonia. I don't yes, know if you heard this, yes. quality uh -huh. control. Definitely. And they pull your credit one last time, you know? So what that means is, if you go and charge your Visa, your MasterCard, and the balance now goes up, then that's gonna impact negatively on your credit score. You know, so, yeah, very important. Second looper, and what was the third looper? What was that? Well, I've heard this, and I don't know if you, you can clarify it, but uh, even if they don't, really purchase something just the actual uh fact that they had the credit pulled is that that's an inquiry inquiry that correct yeah so um you know there's buyers uh, uh, many times they they purchase in a home and they go out and, and shop around for a vehicle for their kid you know going to college and whatnot not not because um they're shopping around on the underwriter's eyes they're gonna think you actually bought the vehicle so they're gonna require a letter from the actual dealership you know because they can see where you've been shopping around with this furniture, cars, and whatnot. So they can, they're gonna require a letter from the dealership that you don't have an acquired new debt. So things can get complicated, right, at that point. So it, your credit is on freeze, basically. So the way, you, the way your credit was when you initiated the application, that's the way it needs to be at the end. So very important, very important. So, so yeah. basically, buyers beware. Don't get overly anxious. Wait till you close on that home before you go wanting to furnish it. That's right, right. <laughs> yes. And I guess those are our, our three bloopers for the day. I and then we can do some more tomorrow. I can, I can we'll, yeah. have some homework. We have some more tunes soon. <laughs> if you have any ideas or any uh, topics that you'd like us to talk about, feel free to comment on our uh, comments on our business page. And uh, we'll talk visit us for more information at homeworkatchuston.com. You're going to see the link below this and also visit Sonia Trevino with uh, Remax Universal. And we are with the Home Legacy team. Thank you so much for your, for your assistance. Bye.